wedding is not simply a social or legal contract not simply even contract between two souls that have fallen in love wedding is beyond all this social legal and gender attraction it is a sacrament it is a divine law the divine law is ordained by heaven it's uh, a matter of understanding the divine nature of the female as well as the male getting into a life contract to understand the uh, energy of each other it is philosophically speaking understanding the yin and yang the purusha and prakriti in sanskrit especially for a woman marriage or wedding ceremony itself is very very important she plans for it and dreams about it and then celebrates it with her friends and relatives more than a man because it's the woman who is going to be the nucleus of the family that's going to be created down the road and she is the most important person in designing the life of the new couple there is a saying that uh, if a man succeeds there is a woman behind it it is true in almost all cultures it's because the woman brings in the stability you see this enacted uh, even in divine weddings the divine weddings uh, are performed in india between uh, god and a goddess it is celebrated uh, in all the temples and people go and participate in that uh, the ceremony is done similar to the ceremony of human beings getting married and it takes place on certain stars and certain months the one upcoming one called the pangani utram puru falcani is the star sacred for the goddess's wedding with the god so what's happening here is really you are following a divine model and this is not simply uh, a superstition because the goddess does exist and then they bless the model that they have brought into existence for organizing the society on this earth plane and then also making people to understand what it is to be a male or what it is to be a female and what it is to be united in order to experience a spiritual life which is a married life married life is a spiritual life more importantly for more practical purposes uh, these uh, days are astrologically very significant bringing the relationship energy so participating in the wedding of the god and the goddess is going to bring a uh, good luck for relationship it's a divine sacred sacrament uh, giving hope and nurture for the human beings.